Earthbed. Hello, earthquake enthusiasts. Welcome back to EarthPen. Today, we're venturing into the seismic realm to explore two crucial aspects of earthquakes, intensity and magnitude. Join me as we uncover the science behind these measurements and how they help us understand the impact and power of earthquakes. Introduction to earthquake intensity and magnitude. Let's begin with the basics. When an earthquake strikes, we want to know two things, how strongly it's felt at different locations and how big it is. That's where earthquake intensity and magnitude come into play. Earthquake intensity. Earthquake intensity is a measure of how strong the shaking is at a specific location. It's often expressed using the modified Mercalli intensity scale, which ranges from I, not felt, to 12, total destruction, dot, factors affecting intensity. Several factors influence earthquake intensity, including the earthquake's depth, distance from the epicenter, local geology, and building construction. These factors can cause varying levels of shaking, magnitude versus intensity. It's important to note that intensity and magnitude are not the same. Intensity measures the effects of an earthquake at a specific location, while magnitude quantifies the earthquake's size and energy release. Earthquake magnitude. Earthquake magnitude is a measure of the total energy released by an earthquake. It's expressed on the Richter scale, which is logarithmic. Each whole number increase on the scale represents a tenfold increase in amplitude of seismic waves. Calculating magnitude, seismologists use data from seismometers to calculate earthquake magnitude. The greater the amplitude and duration of seismic waves, the higher the magnitude effects of earthquake magnitude. Magnitude directly affects an earthquake's potential for destruction. Larger magnitude earthquakes release more energy and can cause widespread damage, especially when shallow and near populated areas. Global distribution, earthquakes of varying magnitudes occur all over the world. The ring of fire encircling the Pacific Ocean is particularly active due to tectonic plate boundaries. Preparedness and safety, understanding earthquake intensity and magnitude is vital for preparedness. Seismically resilient buildings, early warning systems, and emergency plans are essential for minimizing the impact of earthquakes. In conclusion, earthquake intensity and magnitude are invaluable tools for assessing and responding to seismic events. They provide critical information about the shaking experienced by communities and the overall power of earthquakes. Thanks for joining us today on EarthPen. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your thoughts or questions about earthquake intensity and magnitude in the comments below. Until next time, stay informed and stay safe. Once again, this is EarthPen. Learning has never been this easy for anyone, anywhere.